Hill District is where I grew up, it's where I'm from. Not really having a typical childhood, you just see things that uh, as a kid you probably don't, most kids wouldn't really see. And just like, as far as crimes, killings, it's definitely rough. I'm happy I went through all that. It made me who I am today. And uh, I think it just made me a better person and just made me want to succeed even more in life. My brother is uh, someone who had a big influence on me just growing up. I remember seeing him shot and like seeing him on the ground and he was basically like just staring at me and he got shot seven, eight times. He felt like I saved his life just being there and just being him seeing me. I know he, I remember the whole time just him just being in critical condition and just fighting through that. And I think that just made me stronger as well, just saying that if he could fight through that, man, like anything, I could fight through all this. Like there's not nothing else that I can experience. And when you experience death or see someone going through that, it's just, it, it makes you so much tougher. And he always pushed me to uh, be as successful as I can. So what's basketball giving you in life? It's given me opportunity to really take care of my family. Where I come from, not too many people make it out. So them to see me is like, it give kids hope and real possibility. You're not stuck in that environment. Like, you, there is a way out. Big play DJ's, he's got Ted in on his neck. And another big play delivered by big play DJ. Mike Dog, they call him. He gave everyone nicknames. And it was like a name that stuck with me because I football, I was really good at football and I just always made plays everywhere level I go to. Now people catch on and they, I think uh, it's, it's a good name for me. I like it. And you gotta bring games if you've got a tattoo on you. <laughs> NBA was, it was a great experience for me. I mean, just been, especially just everything, adversity I had to overcome. Probably one of the best teams in college basketball and uh, get hurt, uh, tore my ACL. I think that really put me in a bad situation once I got healthy and having a great year in the D-League and just to get called up and signed for the rest of the year, it was, it was like amazing for me just to see how far I came in a short period of time. What attracted you to the NBL? I wanted to come and prove I could win. I seen an opportunity with a team that won it last year and they just needed it was a few pieces away from trying to repeat and I thought it was a great opportunity for me just with the players that they had and what I can bring to the team to help uh, try to win another championship for them.